your tax? Well, one of the best ways to save tax is by claiming HRA exemption. However, to claim the HRA exemption, you need to submit the rent receipts to your HR. Watch this video till the end to find out how to calculate your HRA exemption and generate rent receipts within seconds. Hi everyone, I am Simran from Clear and we are India's largest tax and financial services platform where we have served more than 6 million tax filers. Subscribe to our channel to learn more about saving taxes and filing your income tax returns. Salaried individuals who live in rented houses can claim the HRA to lower their taxes significantly. However, if you don't live in a rented accommodation, this allowance is fully taxable. HRA is the salary component received towards the rent payment and is allowed as a deduction from taxable salary under Section 10, 13A of the Income Tax Act. To learn more about deductions and other tax related basics, check the playlist linked in our description box below. The tax reduction available as HRA is the least of the following amounts. First, actual HRA received. Second, 50% of basic salary plus DA for those living in metro cities. Third, 40% of basic salary plus DA for those living in non-metros. And fourth, actual rent paid should be less than 10% of basic salary plus DA. If you are paying a rent of over rupees 1 lakh annually, then you must provide your landlord's PAN, else you may lose out on the HRA exemption. Landlords without a PAN must be willing to give you a declaration as per circular number 82013 dated 10th October 2013. Though HRA is a popular tax declaration option that helps save tax, calculating it correctly is complex. But do not worry, Clear's HRA calculator can help you calculate the accurate HRA exemption amount you can claim while filing your idea. Our expert will now show you how to calculate your HRA exemption in just a few minutes by using Clear's HRA exemption calculator. Click on the Use our HRA Exemption Calculator for free here link provided in the description box below. It will lead you to our HRA Exemption Calculator page. On this page, first enter your basic salary receipt, enter the dearness allowance receipt. Please note that only government and people working in public sector will receive the dearness allowance. If you work in any other sector, you can leave that place blank. Next, enter the HRA received. You can find the HRA received or provided by your employer or your company in your pay slip or salary slip. Next, enter the total rent paid by you. Next, select if you live in Delhi, Mumbai, Kolkata or Chennai. Delhi, Mumbai, Kolkata or Chennai are considered as metropolitan cities. Next, enter your email address. Click on the calculate button. Your HRA exemption will be calculated within seconds. As you can see, 50% of the basic salary received is rupees 25,000. HRA received is rupees 25,000. Excess of rent paid over 10% of salary is rupees 10,000. The HRA exemption limit is the least of these three. Therefore, the amount of exempted HRA is rupees 10,000 and the HRA chargeable to tax is rupees 15,000. Since the amount of exempted HRA for a month is rupees 10,000, then for a year, you can claim a total exempted HRA amount of Rs. 1,20,000. Thus, you can save tax of Rs. 1,20,000 by claiming your HRA. Is the HRA calculator making sense? If it is, then write clear in the comments below. You need to submit rent receipts to your HR to claim the HRA exemption. Creating your rent receipts from scratch can be quite confusing. However, with Clear's Rent Receipt Generator, you can generate rent receipts in just a few seconds. Plus, our free rent receipt generator will never be rejected by the Income Tax Department. 
Now let's look at the demo of how to use Clear's free rent receipt generator. Click on the get your rent receipts generated for free here link provided in the description box below. It will lead you to this page. On this page, enter your monthly rent. Enter your house address and click on the proceed button. Enter your name. Enter your email. Enter the name of your house owner. Enter your house owner's PAN number. However, this is optional. Thus, if you do not have the PAN number of your house owner, then you can leave this place blank. Next, enter from when you would like to generate the rent receipt and till when you would like to generate the rent receipt. For example, if you are filing your ITR for the year 2021-2022, then you would need to generate the rent receipts from April 2021 till March 2022. And then click on the Generate Receipts button. As you can see on the screen below, all your rental receipts will be generated from the month you would like to receive the rent receipts till the month you would have entered to get the rent receipts. On the rental receipts, you can see the amount of the rent paid, your name, your address, the period for which the receipt is generated and your landlord's name. You can scroll down the page to see all the rental receipts like in the example here for the financial year 21-22 you can see that the receipts have been printed from April 2021 till March 2022 you can also take the printout of all these receipts by clicking on the Print Receipts button here and submit it to your HR to claim your HRA exemption. Alternatively, these rental receipts will also be sent to your email. Enter at the time of generating these receipts. You can take the printout of the receipts from your email also. So folks, I hope you understood how to calculate your HRA exemption and generate rent receipts to submit to your HRA easily in just a few minutes. If you have any more questions, leave a comment below and we will clarify your doubts. Do not forget to subscribe to our channel for more tax related content. Thank you and have a nice day.